Hi everyone, welcome to Melissa's Home Cooking. Today I'm going to show you how to make homemade fresh pasta using two different methods. We're going to use the Kenwood mixer with the pasta maker. As well as for those that do not have a mixer, we're going to use a bowl and make it by hand. Homemade fresh pasta is always a winner and tastes so much better than the dry one that you bought in the shop. But convenience sake and for times when I'm busy, I still use the dry ones but my family absolutely loves the homemade fresh pasta than the one that we bought in the shop. Um, so we have here in front of us the Kenwood mixer with all the attachment for the pasta maker, the K-Baker and it's really great this mixer, it just comes with different attachments that you can make different shape of pasta but we can uh, do that by hand as well if you do not have a mixer. So for the dough, we have here 300 grams of all-purpose flour, 3 eggs and about 1.5 teaspoon of salt. For a rule of thumb, for every 100 grams of all-purpose flour, just add 1 egg and half teaspoon of salt. So um, the pasta maker comes with the measuring cup as well. So for 300, we need the eggs measurement up to about 300 gram measurement on the cup. So we're going to get started by using the mixer to make the dough. So firstly, we're going to add in the 300 gram of all-purpose flour. And we're going to add in the salt. And beat the egg. If you're using the mixer, just got to make sure the measurement is about 300 gram on the cup that's provided by the pasta maker. So we can very easy and fast using this method. We're just going to attach the k beater and then we're just going to start whizzing it. Put it on the speed of minimum. So we're going to keep doing this and then you can cut it into length into the length that you want it so we're just going to cut into length so it's about that and then just going to pull it apart you can dust with a little bit of flour be sticking Use the second method for those that do not have a mixer. We're just going to use a bowl and make it by hand. So we have here 300 gram of all-purpose flour, one and a half teaspoon of salt. As a rule of thumb, every hundred gram of 
all-purpose flour with half teaspoon of salt and one egg for every 100 gram flour. So here we have about 300 gram. This will fit about three to four people. So we're going to do that. And then we have three eggs here. We're going to beat the eggs and we're going to mix it well in the middle of the bowl. And just going to put the eggs in. And I'm going to mix everything in. Cutter, we're just going to cut that into the strip. We're going to make for to shape, and so we're going to cut them. We're going to roll the pasta dough until the desired thickness that you want. To. Normally, about one to two millimeter thick. So here you go guys, this is our homemade pasta using the hand instead of the uh, mixer with the pasta maker. So um, now we're going to boil a big pot of water and put a teaspoon of salt and once the water is boiled, we're going to cook the pasta and serve with your favourite sauce. To cook the pasta, we're going to boil a pot of water and let it boil. When it's boiled, we're going to add in a teaspoon of salt. the water is boiled we're going to cook the pasta just going to put them all in and just going to start fresh pasta will cook faster than the dry one so should be cooked Pasta should cook between one to five minutes depending on how thickness of pasta is. So see it's nearly done. Looking really nice. So now the pasta is cooked, we're just gonna drain it up. Hi guys, here is our homemade pasta with two different methods, the using the stand mixer as well as using hand with a bowl. So we enjoy today's cooking and don't forget to check my video coming up how to make the sauce to go with your fresh pasta. Look forward to see you again next time.